Hey guys, Andrew here at Terrytown RV again, and I've got something amazing to show you today. We're here in Grand Rapids, Michigan in the world's largest warehouse. It's something that you gotta come see for yourself. But today I wanna to talk about the Jayco Terrain 19Y. This thing is for the people that are trying to get actually off grid. I know that you see the YouTube videos of people building out vans and spending their life in these things. They spend a lot of money to try and get to where this thing comes standard. So with this type of vehicle, this is four wheel drive. It's on that Mercedes uh, chassis with lots of really cool features. They're gonna help you stay safe on the road. It is a diesel engine. Um, so you're gonna, it's gonna last longer. You're gonna get a little bit better mileage. Um, and also some of the features that are inside the cab are what makes this thing really, truly easy to drive and an amazing, amazing, amazing unit. So walking right back, you're gonna see that they have some blacked out rims uh, with some very nice aggressive off-road tires to help with that four wheel drive because all tires are gonna be moving and pushing forward. So also they include a really cool outside table that is adjustable right when you see here and an armless awning. It actually has a wind sensor on it. So if the winds pick up, it's gonna go ahead and pull this thing right inside. Uh, table's real easy to fold up, locks. You've got your low point drains in a really easy area there. They do a really nice rock slider step here on the sides. And then this also has a really cool screen that comes down. Now, something else that this package has on it, as you can see right up front here, it has off-road lights on the front and back. So this is something that you can truly get off grid and get away from the campgrounds. Maybe you don't wanna be next to the Smiths and the Joneses right sandwiched in there on a cement pad and you actually wanna get out in the woods. This thing will let that happen in the way that the batteries are configured and the solar and the extra alternator in here. This thing is gonna let you use everything that's in here with the inverter that comes with it. We'll get into that a little bit later. First, we're gonna take a look at the cab. So I'm gonna have you step over to the side. We're gonna get inside. So right when you open the door, you notice that it's a very spacious, upright cab. Now, what's nice about this is this is something that anybody can drive. I mean, if you're scared about driving one of these big rigs or something, this isn't that. So what this is, is this is easy drivability and it's gonna be just like driving a car. And what they did is with the J-Ride, it actually has extra suspension and springs, so it's gonna hold a little more stable going down the road, so when a truck passes, you're not getting that wobble back and forth. And then it also has extra protection in the back, which is also gonna hold you a lot more still when you're driving around. So right when you see this, you get up in your cab, and these chairs are adjustable, and I am a big boy. So I'm six foot one, I'm not gonna give you my weight, but I am kind of fat. So uh, with this thing, you have a beautiful dash system. It actually works just like an Alexa where you can say, hey Mercedes, take me to the next, uh, the next gas station and it will put it in the coordinates for you and take you there. Now this also has active lane assist, so it's gonna keep you in the lanes when you're driving. Uh, to your next destination. It's also gonna have adaptive cruise control. So you can set that cruise control and it's gonna know if it's coming up on somebody, it's gonna set that speed right. So you're not having to hit the brake and reset and hit the brake and reset. So I, I feel like that's a, a really cool feature that this has. Um, it also has excellent parking control. So what it has is a rear view camera, but then it also has the overhead view so you can see your surroundings. So it's really gonna help you keep this coach looking better for longer where you're not gonna have dings and scratches all over the sides. You can do those out in the woods if you'd like, but that does help you with that kind of, that view around it. So also these two chairs will spin around and take you with extra seating out in the cab. Uh, they're fully adjustable up and down. Uh, you also have reclining with both of these, but now stepping in the back here, it also gives you two more chairs and I moved one of them forward to show you when these two spin, there is enough room for four people. And then this chair actually moves out a little bit into the aisleway, so you're not quite crammed like a airline, if you will. So we'll start right here in the kitchen. And something that I really like about this kitchen, they, they're doing an induction cooktop. 
but you have your fridge out here which makes it really accessible just for grabbing a drink or something when you're standing outside and you've got that table down. Also, like I said, this comes down with a screen and there is a screen in the back to create kind of a screen room atmosphere in here. But something that is really cool that they're doing is they're giving you extra counter space here. So if you wanna move this induction cooktop over and you wanna have more prep space, you have that. So as well as, there is tons of drawer space here. So I like what they're doing with their Euro locks. So you've got good cabinet space up top and then that locks it so that's not gonna come out again. You also have tons of nice drawers, uh, a really nice pantry over here. And something that I thought was pretty cool is this actually comes out, I don't know if you can see that, but then it makes extra table space here. So you actually have tons of prep space in this kitchen for it being such a small kitchen. So moving over to this side, up top here, you have all of your controls for your solar. Um, you also have your bed control in the back, your stereo, some extra storage, some storage up top there. Something I didn't mention is over here, you actually have a table that goes down there that can fold out. So you do have a nice table for eating arrangement with everybody. And then you actually have an electric window here. So that's pretty cool. You have integrated screens and shades on your windows. And then something else that nice, nice that they're doing is the J command with Firefly. So you can actually hook that up to your phone and control everything while laying in your bed or up in the cab. Um, moving right back, you've got a Max Air fan, uh, one of the XLs, so a little bit bigger. You have speakers inside and outside, so you can listen to your music wherever you want. And then looking at this gorgeous little bathroom, something I really like about this is those bamboo storage racks. So if you truly are enjoying the outdoors and you come back from kayaking and you've got wet clothes, wet gear, that's a good place to store that stuff is on those bamboo racks or muddy shoes that you just cleaned off. Great kind of organization in there. Now, as you can see back here, our bed is down right now. Um, it, it is pretty cool how this bed goes down and then comes up. You have your AC located back here. Um, you also have a couple lights. And he's gonna walk around and we're gonna show you some of the other stuff looking from the other side. So instantly when you walk around the back, you see this huge opening and you see that you can put that screen down as well. So if you really want to be in touch with nature and kind of get back to that tent sleeping, you can have that kind of feeling. Now you've got plenty of room for two people here. And then you also have a master control over here so you don't have to get up out of bed. So they actually have a light master, an awning. Um, you've got your accent light buttons as well. So any of the things that you need to turn on and off, you don't want to get up from bed, you can either use that or you can use your Firefly system on your phone. So what I'm going to do here is go ahead and put the bed up to show you the other amazing part of this whole thing. So easy with the touch of a button, your bed goes up, you can fold your blankets and pillows up and there's actually enough space when it goes up that you can leave that stuff just right on top of there. You're not going to hurt anything. So right when you see here, you have a huge cargo storage. So if you've got bikes or you've got a kayak that you want to keep inside, paddle board, things like that, you can put them in here or you have some roof racks, two different roof racks up top that you can lash down up there. But you do have a moving uh, tie down system here on the floor, which there's lots of different ways you can use this. Um, it's, it kind of depends on what kind of gear you're carrying. But right away, you notice that in the back here, you also have a Nautilus system with a hot and cold shower outside. So you can kind of set up your own little shower station out here if you don't want to use the smaller one inside. Really get in touch with nature and, and be able to shower outside hot and cold. Uh, really be one with the outdoors. What I like about this Nautilus system is they do it by a color coding chart. So you always know where your, your dials are going to have to be switched. They take a lot of the guesswork out of it. So moving outside, I want to talk a little bit about some of the features that you're going to see like the lithium batteries inside. So what makes that so cool 
is this thing, like I said, is fully off-grid capable. So with the extra alternator on there, you're gonna be able to charge your batteries all the way up with just two hours of drive time or you've got 200 watts of solar on top, which can be expanded to 400 watts. And you're talking about a 210 amp hour lithium battery, and it's a smart battery. So you can Bluetooth monitor that, has a heating core, uh, definitely makes that a lot more of the guesswork taken out of that off-grid camping. The other thing that makes this really nice for off-grid camping is a cassette toilet that's outside. Now, I don't know if you're familiar with a cassette toilet, but what that does is it makes it so you can literally take your waste out and you can go take this where you need to and it's on wheels. On wheels and you have a carry handle that pops out from here. So if you needed to, now if you're using all biodegradable materials that are going down there, of course your own waste is biodegradable, but you also have to be know what your toilet paper is and any kind of liquids that go down there you can actually go dig a hole out in the woods and bury this so if you're truly out there out out in the woods and you want to get rid of some waste that is a way that you can do it and i like that they actually put a light over here so when you're fiddling with that it's not as bad so this also has a hydronic heating system and that is awesome so the hydronic heating system gives you a lot more of an even heat and you're not getting that blown in heat that's kind of blowing dust and allergens around and you're not hearing that fan kick on and off all the time. So it's very quiet, works very well, it's very efficient. So you're not having to keep refilling that propane and everything all the time. It's just gonna be able to ride with that. So moving back to the back is another feature that I wanted to talk about that I just think is genius with these. So what they did is they created a ladder. A lot of times when you go up on a roof and you've got racks to put things, nobody wants to climb up from the back and trying to fight those front lash down straps, trying to get kayaks or things off the top. So this ladder actually comes off and you can move it over to the side from the back to the front. So you can be right where you need to be when you're trying to unlash those things on the roof. Whether you have a ski coffin up there with extra gear, a ski coffin with skis or snowboards, stuff like that, but nobody wants to climb from the back and try and fight their way up. So with this system, it's gonna truly get you off grid. It's truly gonna get you on the road. And if this is your next venture, we'd love you to check us out at Terrytown RV in Grand Rapids, Michigan. My name's Andrew. Please give me a call at 616-302-3552. We'd love to earn your business. I'd love to talk more about pricing on this. I know that people get upset that we don't always do pricing on our videos, but you have to remember that the prices change and fluctuate all the time. And it always depends on what kind of rebates we have, to what kind of deals we can get you. But right now is a great time to buy. And we have one of the only ones here in the country right now. Uh, there's a few floating around, but we wanna give you the best deal and the best experience. So again, give me a call, Andrew Terrytown RV. Look forward to hearing from you.